coming at you from Soap Opera Spy, your number one source for daytime soap spoilers, updates, and more. Hi, General Hospital fans. It's Anne-Marie from Soap Opera Spy with all your hot soap news, spoilers, updates, and more. Now, before we get started with your General Hospital spoilers, if you're new to the site, kindly press that subscribe button and please turn on notifications to make sure you never miss a video from us. Hey, General Hospital fans, today we're going to talk about your early next week spoilers. So basically, we have everything that's going to go down in Port Charles the week of April 22nd, where you're going to see Carly and Sonny's showdown, Nina discovers betrayal, Sam's protection plan, and so much more. So let's dive right into those spoilers so I can reveal how it's all going to go down. General hospital spoilers, that would be for the week of April 22 to April 26th, reveal that Sonny Corinthos will become increasingly unhinged the longer he goes without the proper medication dose. Sonny is barely getting any meds at all, so it's not surprising that he's growing more and more paranoid and having more and more outbursts. Ava Jerome should get the pill analysis results back soon, but will she come clean to Sonny about what she's learned or keep the news to herself? It may score Ava some brownie points if she gives Sonny updates and helps him figure out that his meds are being sabotaged. However, it would also work against Ava's efforts to manipulate Sonny since he's more rational when he's fully medicated. Of course, Ava will also have to worry about the possibility that she'll become a med tampering suspect. Since Ava messed with Morgan Corintho's meds in the past, she could be accused of using the same strategy to mess with Sonny's own prescription and get Sonny under her control. Now, the only logical thing that Ava could do would be to tell Sonny, and they could both work to try to find out what's going on. But my prediction is that Ava will keep this all to herself because Ava has a master plan that she's been playing Sonny. So this could work in her favor if she tells him nothing. Now, there's also a chance Ava's working with Valentine Cassidyne and simply doesn't know about this part of his plot. So she might confront him sooner or later when she starts to suspect that perhaps Valentine is behind all of this. Regardless, Sonny will be busy getting into a heated showdown with Carly Spencer in the meantime. So they may fight about Jason Morgan, his Metrocord gift, and the recent attack on Jagger Cates. Carly may accuse Sonny of sending those thugs, but he might find out Carly spent the night in Agent Kate's suite and act like she only cares because John is her new boy toy. Carly has seen Sonny spin out of control before from not taking his meds, so she should be really suspicious about what's going on at this point. Now, as for Nina, she'll discover something that catches her off guard. Will Nina find out Sonny currently hates Jason and ultimately realizes Ava duped her? Now, she should figure this out, too. I mean, Ava's living with her husband or her ex-husband, if we want to call him that, and she keeps saying that she's working on things, but, you know, Ava's not making much progress for her, and we know that Ava's working behind the scenes against Nina. So it should be about time that Nina figures that one out. Ava's been keeping up the con, and Ava acted like Sonny would be touched if Nina would sell her half of the Metro Court to Jason. Since Ava played up on how Sonny and Jason were like brothers, Nina may corner her and demand some answers after the sale provides Sonny's wrath. It's about time that Nina started to smell the coffee and realize that Ava is not her friend and is working against her. Over with Sam McCall, she'll do everything in her power to make sure Jason keeps his distance from Danny Morgan, and we know that's not going to work. Sam will deliver another warning to Jason, 
but that may not stop Danny from defying his mother's wishes and sneaking off to see Jason anyway. Other General Hospital spoilers say Willow Corinthos will catch up with Drew Kane and offer some comfort in the aftermath of his split from Carly. Willow might assure Drew that he'll move on in no time and leave him flashing back to his sizzling encounter with Nina in his office. Now just imagine an interesting storyline could be Willow walking in on Drew and Nina in his office on the desk hitting the sheets. But so far there's really no solid spoilers that that's going to happen. Next, Lois will show off some amazing knowledge when it comes to Deception's brand and list of products. Maxie Jones will be impressed, so she might hire Lois in a new position with the company. Since Sasha Gilmore only stepped back in as spokesmodel because it was an emergency, perhaps Lois could slide into the role on a more permanent basis. Well, I don't really see Tracy being happy about this. She's probably going to think that Lois is not a good person to be the face of deception, but we'll see how this plays out. General Hospital spoilers say the week of April 22nd to April 26th will bring some unexpected moments in Port Charles, so stick with us for more predictions on all the highs and lows. What do you think, General Hospital fans? What are you looking forward to seeing most the week of April 22nd to April 26th? Hit those comments and let us know your thoughts. And meanwhile, stick with us for all the up-to-date, sizzling General Hospital spoilers, news, and more. And if you're new to our site, make us your top General Hospital source by pressing that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and if you like our video, give us a like by pressing the like button. See you next time.